Now we are doing exercise 1.2, question number 5, Roman number 4. Roman number 4, the question is, represent the following number on the number line. Roman number 4, it is root over 20. I need to represent root number 20 on a number line. Okay, so solution. How to represent root number, root number 20? Root over 20 on a number line. And the simple way to represent or to do this is you are going to draw a straight line. Let's draw a straight line. Let's take. Okay, first of all, we can write. We can write 20 is equal to 16 plus 4. Again, the question may come. So, why are you writing 16 plus 4? You can add on 19 plus 1. You can add on 18 plus 2. You can add on 17 plus 3. Whatever you can write. But why are you writing 16 plus 4? The reason is 16 can be written as 4 square and 4 can be written as 2 square. Here, we cannot write 19 as any squares and 18 as any square like that. So, that is the reason that I am writing like this. Now, what we will do is we will draw a number line. So let us draw a number line here. So this is your number line. Now after that, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, so I can write down here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, minus 1, uh, 0, minus 1, like this. After this, after this, what you can do is take 4, okay, what, what to do after this is, you can take this 4 here, okay, on the number line from 0 to 4. You draw a number, let me check another color, let me take green. And from here, from 0, you draw till 4. Now, 0 to 4, you are taking 4. Next is 2. So, this 2, you are going to draw from 4 upside, okay. You are going to draw from 4 upside. So, how to do that? is from here this point use your protector and take two distance okay not one like how much you have taken from zero to two take same thing like that and draw a line i hope it will be something like this if i'm here and a little bit mistake because i'm not exactly using scale here so i may do some mistakes pardon me for that but it may look something like this after that, please join these two lines. So, your things becomes, this is A, this is B, and this is C. I am writing A, B, and C. What is the distance A, B? Distance A, B, you are taking 4. B, C, you are taking 2. Now, I want to find out what is A, C here. So, let me again take the box. So, so in this box, let me write down in triangle, in or using Pythagoras theorem, applying Pythagoras theorem using Pythagoras theorem in triangle ABC. You are using Pythagoras theorem in triangle ABC. So after using Pythagoras theorem in ABC, I can add down AB. AC square is equal to this hypotenuse square is equal to AB square plus BC square. So AC, AB square, AB is how much? 4 square plus BC is how much? 2 square. 4 square, 4, 4 is 16, 2, 2 is 4. Right. So. 4, 4 is 16, 2, 2 is 4. 16 plus 4, 20. But I want to find out AC. 
AC will be square will come this side it will become root 20 so how much is AC root over 20 so how much I got AC is root over 20 now I got AC is root over 20 I just need to take this with the help of a compass take compass take compass and the pin side you put this side and the pencil side you put this side take this and draw a curve draw a curve like this and when you draw a curve you draw properly with your compass and you'll get this point and the point which you get here this point let's say let me use green one this point name it p so now ap is equal to ap is equal to how much ac right and what is ac ac is root 20 right ap is equal to ac is equal to is 20 is represented on a number line on the number line or you can name your number line you can name your number line as a or x x dias on a number line x or x dias like this also you can just name it okay so it's how you want to write down you can just write down some teachers used to write down the name of the number line also so you can do that also but the main fundamental idea is to know how to draw i hope this is clear to you that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video